What's good YouTube man, it's your boy T23 bro and we're back at it again with another video you guys, yes sir and as you guys can see by the title today, we are running Snake Way you guys. Uh, this entire episode is pretty much going to be the run of Snake Way and then also like I've got to just kind of sort of talk to you guys and let you guys know, uh, you know say, stuff that's been going on and whatnot. I guess like, you know what I'm at the time of recording this anyway. You know what I'm saying? And yeah, so uh, let's get right into it, you guys. Because uh, we ain't trying to dilly dally it waste no time. Alright, so I did go ahead and uh, mark a little thing here just because, I mean, I'm not going to teleport back, but in case when I, if I ever die again and I want to run Snake Way or whatever, just in case I want to forget something, then you know what I'm saying? I could do that. But we're going to go ahead and go past King Yemma. <coughs> We're gonna we're literally going to run this like Goku did in the show so there will be no like flying because I remember one time I did it off camera uh, with like I think I did it off camera I can't remember I ran snake way real quick and then and I did all that and I flew it and it was like super duper quick so uh, I don't know if I should do this with the cape on or not but we'll see how slow we run with it off and then on, or we'll see how, how slow we run with it on plus we're gonna be in turbo mode too so it'll be a little a little faster you know say but yeah let's go okay well while we're sitting here running and whatnot um i haven't done pretty much any training since the last time that i was on here so this is gonna like i said this entire video is for the most part gonna be like unedited except for the bit when i actually do get to king kai's planet and whatnot so yeah but anything else is this entire thing is pretty much gonna be unedited so uh from the moment pretty much of the start of recording to you know when once we you know the run is, is over and done with so uh but yeah uh, I guess to kind of sort of get it to the whole, you know what I'm saying, quote unquote, like, this entire story and whatnot of what we're doing, um, I mean, like, I guess, I never really fully, because I never fully explained it, but basically in this series, we are, like, you know what I'm saying, like, quote unquote, like, we're like, you know what I'm saying, we're, we're, well, one, we're in the make -in. And like, you know, you remember in the story mode when the Namekians like found a new planet or whatever and blah blah Like I was one of the Namekians that ended up staying, you know what I'm saying, on Earth And, but like, I was born like on Earth, you know what I'm saying Kind of sort of like Piccolo was and everybody else was, you know, so like I was born on Earth So like, I was able to say that kind of sort of stuck around And like, kind of sort of was like, but I was like pre, I was like, I was like, am I I was in like, you know how like when in the Dragon Ball Piccolo how K Piccolo hatched Piccolo for the egg. I was kind of sort of in my egg the entire time. And years later, I now hatch with, you know what I'm saying, being like as weak as everybody was and, you know what I'm saying, not strong. And so I'm training now and blah, blah. So like, that's why I say I'm like a lost in Maggie because I don't know, you know what I'm saying, like who about, you know what I'm saying, what egg I came from. I don't know what happened. I just, I just hatched from an egg and, you know what I'm saying, the Z fighters are what I found me and now I'm here. So, you know, and I'm training under the ways of the Demekian, you know what I'm saying, uh, Kami and Piccolo, and yeah, and then Grand of the Guru when I make it to Namek, so there's that too, but like I said, we're running Snake Way because running Snake Way is pretty much going to be like, you know what I'm saying, like it's going to be pretty, pretty nice, pretty nice. So I'm actually going to go ahead and take off the weight, I think we should run a bit faster now. Um, I think the weight was slowing us down a fair bit, but the weight doesn't really do much to us, to be honest. But, like, you know, so we're gonna do it anyway. Uh, so I guess that's kind of sort of the lore of the story in a way. Like, uh, for the most part, that's pretty much it. Like, you know, said, so just to let you guys kind of sort of, in case you guys were wondering what it really was or what's going on and whatnot. But that's pretty much the lore of the story. Now, um, you know what I'm saying? I guess to. Um, talk about another topic while we're running the snake way. Uh, basically, at the time of recording this, the survival of the Majins action series, the first episode, came out. Um, today is actually a Thursday. Um, I actually the and the episode came out on Tuesday. And the next episode of this series, which is by the time of recording this, is going to be number four. Uh, it's gonna be coming out tomorrow on Friday. I remember one time in a video I said that my posting schedule was Tuesdays and uh, it was Tuesdays and Thursdays, but in reality it's actually Tuesday and Friday. But yeah. So anyway, um, but uh, pretty much, yeah. Uh, I guess you know. Say I hope you guys are enjoying that series. Uh, I haven't looked at the views and all like that in a while. So uh, and like since at the time of recording this, since yesterday. 
so and i probably won't look at them again till tomorrow when i go upload the video upload the fourth episode of this series but um <clears throat> i just uh this is one to let you guys know man just go check out those videos honestly because those videos you know what i'm saying I, I i'm actually like getting like a little bit more serious into my editing and whatnot and like i'm like actually like trying to figure out what sounds you guys like and how what the style of the editing that i do is and stuff like that because i never really know what you guys like the style of editing that you guys like i don't know if you guys like the ss talking that i do that i took because in this video you guys see um the fourth episode in case you got it but yeah, i mean by the time this comes out um like the fourth episode will probably be like a, a de like a decent amount of days since then but like i'll just say like if you guys can compare the fourth episode to like an episode that I, I did do a lot of talking in where i kind of sort of like cut it short or whatever like if you guys like the shorter cuts then let me know you know what i'm saying and i'll i'll definitely make sure to continue uh, or if you guys like the quick cuts or whatever and less talking i'll make sure to keep that going but if you guys like it when i talk a lot more in the videos then yeah i mean if you guys really like because for this video there will be no fighting no nothing it's literally just gonna be me like honestly just like literally seeing like literally running snake way and talking to you guys like pretty much that is the gist of the story you know what i'm saying right now so you know what i'm saying it's like a little uh pre-warm-up fight to it's like a pre uh, fight pre-warm-up to the next episode after this which will be us fighting vegeta and Napa. so yeah but um i just like i said hope you guys like uh, as always you know what i'm saying enjoy this video um enjoy the past videos make sure if you guys are new make sure you guys subscribe um, if you're not new, just make sure you guys, you know what I'm saying, or I got the bell notifications turned on because, like I say, you know what I'm saying, like, you guys never want to miss video because, like I said, I'm getting back grinding again, you know what I'm saying, so, yeah, but, um, let me see, what else do I want to talk about? Uh, I guess to, like I said, to quickly touch again on the survival of the Majin series, uh, it's a series full of YouTubers. That are, right now is full of YouTubers. There's gonna be other people, I'm sure, join eventually. I don't. I'm not too too sure. Um, I did talk to the guy who, who made the series, my friend Age, and uh, you know, what I'm saying he, it is his series. And I, like I said, I don't know if he's gonna, who all is allowed to join, and who isn't. He just personally invited me, but that's because he was also in my Dragon Block C series that I did before this one. So if you guys. I'm gonna have a go watch that series that I did that they were a part of. Towards the end, they were a part of it, but yeah. Um, but you guys wanna watch that series? You can. Um, but yeah, I don't know if you guys could join. Like I said, but if, if he lets you, if you get, like I said, go into my description. Uh, go subscribe to his YouTube channel, and then pretty much just after that, just go. Uh, pretty much uh, d uh, go to his YouTube channel and go to his. Uh, what's it called? Go to his his discord that's what it is and go uh join in and ask him if you can join because i don't know if it's in public or not but hey we finally made it to uh uh i about to say commies uh uh what's her name king kai's yay hey cool yo what's up we got master jen and king kai i will talk to you in a second master jen uh, let me you know what i'm saying let me bow you know what i'm saying yes sir all right, he said, it is good to see people like you who fight for the ones in need. I can learn God form and Ultra Instinct from him, because he's in Ultra Instinct, that's nice. All right, King Kai, I'm here to talk to you, you know what I'm saying, because I was told I can talk to you and get stronger this way, so am I going to get stronger here? What's up? He says, oh, you are here. I've waited for you. My techniques will be at their strongest as long as you stay good. All right, so my key techniques, we got my spirit bomb, just regular key blast, we're going to learn. Uh, we can learn new skills. We can learn old Kai Ritual, Kyle Ken, and Key Boost. Now, I'm not too, too sure what Key Boost does. I know old Kai's Ritual is a, a, what's called um, it's Gohan's ultimate form. And Kyle Ken obviously is Kyle Ken, and we're here for Kyle Ken. So, we're gonna obviously getting that. Key Boost, maybe we'll come back and get this at a later date, but we're here for the Kyle Ken. You know what I'm saying? Now, if I remember correctly, uh, okay, okay, here it is. It is 400 TP and 5 mine. Per. Now, if I remember correctly, Cow Ken at level, f I want to say 3 is when we could go Cow Ken times 4. So let's find out. So it's our level 1 right now. We're going to go 1 and 3. There we go. And so now, 
We are going to, you guys are going to see me go. Okay, okay. Turn it on. There we go. And let us go. For the world. Turn it on. Oh, there it goes. And. Okay, okay, times two. Kit types three. We should be able to go one more. Car kit types four. Let's go. We shouldn't be able to go no more than this. And yeah, car kit types four is as far as we could go right now. So, in terms of how this works, because it literally says, you know, say the car kit mastery is what we can do. So, pretty much how I'm doing this mastery is. Um, Um, basically, because Goku was not proficient in Kaioken at all, but it did boost his power, because obviously my power is boosted right now. Uh, our power was at 6,000, and now it got boosted up to 8,000, so that's really, really good. Uh, we now do 400 damage. Uh, granted, granted, we are also, like, you know what I'm saying, like, we're weaker right now because of this, but we did get a boost, so that's nice. Um, basically, Goku was not proficient in this. I would say he was a lot more proficient in it than, like, he got pretty, pretty well proficient in it. He was more proficient in it on Namek and pretty much passed this because I would say he pretty much mastered Kaioken. So we are going to get Kaioken mastery to about, because the, the, the base, the mastery for this is 50. Uh, that's the max. And so we're going to get it to, I'm going to say around 25. So when the Kaioken mastery level reaches 25 even, we will pretty much be doing it then. So we're going to get the strain because you should guys see at the top right there it says strain and uh, 9 minutes. So basically that means is that we'll be like weaker. We'll probably have to like walk slower or whatever. So we'll probably run a lot faster now, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Boom, 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 boom. Yes, sir. And so, pretty much, this is what we're gonna be. So, we're gonna be training up here. Uh, you know what I'm saying? I don't think I'm gonna learn uh, uh, Spirit Bomb just because I'm gonna make my own. And yeah, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, that's pretty much what we're doing. But, uh, I, was, I thought I fell off already. But, um, we're just gonna get like as proficient as we can in this, in this, uh, being a cow can. And, you know what I'm saying? And yeah, like I said, when it's at 25. You know what I'm saying? I will probably be back on here. Um, like I said, we want our power level. And now, obviously, my power level, now realistically speaking, my power level won't be able to reach, like, we can actually reach 9,000 in base, right? At, at this where we're at. You know what I'm saying? Just normally. You know what I'm saying? Now, in terms of where my power level is going to be, because that's, that's, that's where we're going to be at. Now, in terms of my power level reaching what it was when Goku fought Goku and uh, fought Vegeta and Nappa, when he used Kaioken times four, which is where we're at, we cannot use it. So it, it won't reach, or it won't reach the high, considering, you know, so no matter what our mastery is at, it won't reach the high. So pretty much we are going to have to uh, rely on the strength of Kaioken as well as the transformations when I get to them. So, because like I said, we only have the one transformation. Um, being the, our big form, you know what I'm saying? If I turn this off real quick and I charge up, we'll probably get a decent power boost from this. Oh, uh, can't even hold it because it's the, the form is so great. All right. We uh, turn Kyle Kid back on. go back up yeah there we go okay so like I said our power level right now is at 6932 so realistically speaking we're gonna have to just spend time being in Kyle Kent now right now I am strained which I forget exactly what strain does but basically it just makes it to where I'm like super weak and I think slow as well like I don't think I'm as fast as I was before but um, I have a pretty good amount of training buddies now uh, to actually fight so I can get strong in this form because I've come down here, you guys see these little demon guys, which their health is at 2,000 and they probably do even more damage than that. So 
uh, because from my knowledge, uh, when I heard is that these guys are supposed to be around Freeze's level, and I think, and I think when I say that and I tell people what the level they're supposed to be around, I think they're supposed to be around Freeze's level in his first form, um, and nothing past that. So I think that if I could beat these guys up, I think we'll, we'll be good. Now I'm probably gonna honestly be finding them like periodically, you know what I'm saying, just on my own terms, I guess, you know what I'm saying, like before, so, yeah, they should really get, like, a, like, a King Kai's, like, car model or something like that, put that up here, honestly, if they could, because they have custom models for these guys, if they could, they could really make this planet, like, round low-key, you know what I'm saying, that could work, too, alright, but I'm gonna mark right here, just so I have it, because I'm gonna, by the time I, by the time I come back here, I'll actually have instant transmission, so I'll, it'll, I'll make it work, but, so we're gonna call this King. Oops. Guys. Um, planet. And we will make it a boot. Because King Kai is boot. There we go. So now, anytime I come back here, when I do, you gotta say, because I'll have its transmission, I'll be able to teleport to Mr. King Kai. You know what I'm saying? Word. Alright. Well, now. Pretty much just a matter of me training, honestly. I mean, like, this, this, this is pretty much what we're doing here. Um, to get the power level up to where it needs to be. You know what I'm saying? Right, we're sitting at 6,932. Um, let me honestly fly up in the air real quick. So, which is where I am not in the safe zone anymore. And there we go. So, all together, we do 312 damage. At maximum, we do 625, but we can't reach that anyway regardless because um, yeah. um, turn off god can there we go alright so in our big form how much damage do we do as of right now in our big form we're doing 689 okay and cow can I think it said we were doing like 400 so we're doing about 300 less and and compared to this so that's also because this giant form is you know the mastery of it is my status as well so you know what i'm saying we're, we're doing we're doing pretty good uh so for the most part like uh we're obviously we're gonna be stronger in this one now once my cow can is you know what i'm saying good i'll be able to pretty much use that cow can on top of this now i probably won't really use this form like like it really was just for like a you know what i'm saying just for the moment that we're sitting here now but like i i definitely am like gonna be super thrilled to use this use this form of cow can to see how much power i can really get now obviously when i'm like this my power level exceeds over nine thousand, which is good but like you know we're not We're not, we're not, we ain't gonna be really, like I said, we ain't gonna be really, we, we're really not gonna be using that form. Oh wow, King Kai is it from here, or if I stand like, I guess, at the actual point of it, it's 3,781 meters away, Jesus, that's crazy, that's a pretty far distance. Um, alright, the strain is about to be gone for less than 5 seconds, 3, 2, 1, and gone. There we go, so, now we're not strained anymore. So, basically how the skill works here is uh it gives the user kai kid kai kid trace race stack accessible and actually whatever blah, blah blah so how this actually works is it does actually double my power um for the most part and i mean consider the fact that we're almost it actually does double my power i don't know if it actually does the times four thing and times four is my power but um basically oops <sighs> there we go basically like um it's going to it's supposed to like actually give us a boost in all of our stats for the most part like at least the ones that actually matter, like strength, dexterity, willpower, you know what I'm saying, whatever. Um, you would think, you would, oh, well, I guess the constitution because it's not really, but, at, well, maybe for the actual type, it, but not the actual, like, I don't get more health or more, because I drains health. But anyway, um, it's like, basically, it does make us stronger for the most part, but like, you know what I'm saying, I think that, like I said, once we get proficient in it a lot more, we'll be better. By the time we get to Freeze's Planet, Kyle Cannon is probably going to be like a must. Um, because, I mean, I will have another transformation here, but, like, we're gonna be, like, a lot stronger, you know what I'm saying, as well with Kyle Ken, because Kyle Ken's gonna be maxed out, man, you know what I'm saying, it's gonna be a lot easier for us to max it out, 
you know what I'm saying, like, once we get back to Earth, you know what I'm saying, to get the master back up, because it's just, I, I just, I have my ways on Earth, on here it's going to be a little, a little harder, but I'm going to be fighting these guys down here for a transplant, so, you know what I'm saying, and whatnot, so it's going to be good, but, uh, might as well use the training points we got right now, which is 132,000, which it really isn't that much, because of the fact that it takes us 882 training points anyway, but, to speed this up, you know what I'm saying, to make this as good as we can get it, we're going to be putting all our points into mine. You know what I'm Every last bit. Because mine is super important when it comes to the training points. Because mine allows us, we're going to get this up to probably 800. Um, and then by the time we get to freeze it, it'll probably be over 1,000. But mind is like super important because it helps us gain. Like obviously the TP gain right here goes up, but like it's it goes up in like a good way at the same time, you know, because we will be able to get training points a lot quicker. And like just to show you real quick, like I'm going to do like a quick little training session against my shadow dummy. This is obviously going to be sped up like post thing, but you guys will get to see, I guess how I've been training or how I train or whatever. So I'm going to show you guys. We got this five thousand weight on. Oh, obviously it's going to do a lot more because we're on King Ice Planet. Now, as you guys see, can't move that well. Even in turbo mode, can't, still can barely move. So, I'm gonna show you guys me training, and you guys are gonna see, like, what this training is actually gonna do. And this was at 500 before, and now it's boosted up to 644. So, note this we are at 826. Now, watch this. So, this is for the people who don't play Dragon Ball, so, you know what I'm saying? Kind of sort of show you guys or, or, or how, we, how we do this. But, TP. 826. Remember this, okay? Remember this number, 826. Now it's time for a quick, uh, what's it called? Demonstration of the training. Speed it up, T. Basically, we were just at 826 TP, and now we just got boosted up to 83,000 TP. Now, you guys were thinking, T, 83,000, that's a lot. Before I upgraded my stuff, we were just at 133,000, you know what I'm saying? That's a lot, you know what I'm saying? It really is a lot. So, like, you guys got to understand, like, it, it, like we are, and it costs us 936 TP, which is obviously more than what this is right here, you know? So, like, I'm just trying to show... I'm just trying to show you guys and tell you guys, you know what I'm saying, like, the training I put in is going to be a little crazy, but it's going to be worth it, it's going to be paid off, because these guys are going to be a lot stronger than they were before. I personally do not think that I will be able to take them on right now, how I am, you know what I'm saying, so I think I need to get a lot stronger than I am right now. But basically, this is the training that we're going to be doing for the next, like, you know what I'm saying, for the next bit, I don't really know how long it's going to take me to do that, but we're going to be doing this training for a while, you know what I'm saying, until, you know what I'm saying, well, we're good. But, uh... Hope you guys enjoyed this video, man. I just want to leave it off right there, man. Because the next time you guys see us, we'll be a lot stronger than we are right now. We'll be able to take on the Saiyans. And we'll pretty much be, you know what I'm saying, strong enough for everything to, you know what I'm saying, to continue with the story. You know what I'm saying? And, and then we're going to be doing more training because Freeze is going to be a whole lot tougher, you know what I'm saying, than Saiyans are right now. And we're also ready to do some space travel. So probably going to be, uh, you know what I'm going to play the Vegeta as well to do some training and whatnot. And I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll be doing some training and whatnot. But, uh, well, after freezing, we'll be going to the Planet of Vegeta to do some training. Obviously, he's probably not gonna really going to help us out too, too much right now. But by that point, you know what I'm saying, it, it should. After we beat the Saiyans, it should definitely help out, help us out a little bit. But anyway, um, 
I'm going to go ahead and end it off here, you guys. I appreciate and love every single one of you guys for watching and tuning into this video and the past videos. If you guys haven't go check them out, make sure you guys go check them out, man, because, you know, so like I said, I post, it, I post twice a week. You know what I'm saying? Every Tuesday and every Friday. You know what I'm saying? So make sure. And obviously, if I miss a day, I'll let you guys know on my Discord, which is why you guys should join the Discord, which link will be in the description. But make sure you guys leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe as well. Don't forget to turn on the bell notification. And I really, really, really would appreciate it if you guys would subscribe, bro, because we are literally, you guys, we are literally 60 subs away from 500. And I would like to hit 500. You know what I'm saying? I would like to be over 500 by the end of the year. But if we can hit 500 by the end of the year, I'd be happy with that too. So make sure you guys subscribe, man. And with all that being said, it's your boy T, and we out. Peace.